Okay, we're going to have to talk. This is what I'm going to call real talk. I was in a group, and they think they be talking real. Now, this is not real. I'm going to tell you something. Real talk. So, I'm at Lazy Acres. It's just like Whole Foods and Sprouts and stuff. I'm at Lazy Acres, and this kid, this child, is helping the father load these five gallon jugs into the basket so I'm trying to beat them back there but I'm actually glad I didn't so while I was at the water pool the alkaline machine I was able to talk to them so they had reverse osmosis distilled water and uh alkaline water you had to click the button for it to alkaline the water and i said i wonder can you alkaline the distilled water and he was like i don't worry about the alkaline water i just get the distilled water i said well it would be nice if they could alkaline the distilled water because i don't think the reverse osmosis take the fluoride out the water and he was like, what? Fluoride good for you. Hold up. Wait a minute. So, you know, I'm talking to him. I'm not arguing with him. I want to listen. See where his head at. Now, remember, this is a white guy. This is a white guy. And um, I said, uh, oh, I thought that's why you wanted the distilled water. So you wouldn't drink fluoride. And he said... No, I'm using this distilled water to make beer. I said, oh, you must not want any impurities in it, like stuff floating around it and stuff, changing the chemical reaction of the beer. He was like, yeah, something like that is better for the beer because I don't want different chemicals in my beer. But if you don't want chemicals in your beer, why would you want to put chemicals in your body? I said, uh, I said, well, uh, the fluoride is bad for you. He said, I got to save my teeth. I said, you got to save what? So I'm looking at this little girl like she has no clue. I said, well, you got to save your teeth. I got to save my pineal gland. And he's like, what? Yeah, so he got to save his teeth and I got to save my pineal gland. So you got to really understand what we're up against. You got black and white people who actually think fluoride is good for them. It's good to ingest it to save the teeth. And I'm looking at this innocent child as if she's caught between two worlds of her father believing that fluoride is good, but it's not good enough for the beer. So, that's just something to think about, long and hard. You got people that really want to ingest this stuff. They think that it's good for the teeth. And you got people that know for a fact that it calcifies the pineal gland. So, yes, this is real talk. And I really don't know what else to say. I'm about to start asking those questions. I'm about to start walking the beaches and stuff. And I'm about to start asking them questions because asking questions don't hurt nothing. You're not forcing nothing on nobody. You just want their response. And this has really initiated that it's time to do the footwork, ask the questions. So the world can see how people really feel, how people really think. People think fluoride is actually good for them. People think that breast formula, I mean milk formula from the pharmaceutical is actually better than a mother's milk. So it's time we finally start seeing this. And once we actually see it, we'll know what direction to take there on out. Peace out. This is Revere Sky.